Don't forget to check out my Patreon where we have exclusive content such as Camp Zero Base One, Seventeen's Nana Tour, Seventeen in the Sioux, Finding Stray Kids, Black Pink House, EXO's Ladder, EXO Showtime, A Pink Showtime, and tons of other content including extra variety shows, K dramas, animes, and movies. Hey guys, Angie here. Today we have TVXQ's Twenty and Two, Ninth Album. Um, obviously we skipped a few years of albums, but I'm definitely looking forward to it. We have a Yuno and a Max solo, like we have solo ones. So I'm looking forward to that. We've of course heard The Way You Are, and I don't really care to like hear the unplugged version that much, to be honest. Um, and of course we reacted to Rebel, Rebel, <laughs> Rebel and Down. So we just have seven songs here, and then next we're gonna do the Killing Voice, which I'm excited about. But let's hop into the video. So I couldn't find. Ooh, bad to turn country there. Can't find. This sounds kind of country, actually. <laughs> this is rodeo too. Um, I, I don't see anything with their names, and I'm like, maybe I should just know who's who at this point. So. So, you know, oh, see, this is gonna expose me. There's only two of them. Is Max? Oh, I'm gonna be so mad. <laughs> I'm not gonna know, guys. I'm so sorry. I just think Yuno has a lower voice, I'm assuming. The lower voice there, you know. Mm. Oh, this is kind of a flop though. Oh. I knew I could trust these guys. I knew I could trust them with the good music to this day, like remaining still good. The thing is, I don't know if they're like. Well, Yuna's a rapper. But I feel like they both do it now. Like, there's no like official, like. Only Max does this, you know, does this tip thing. It's kind of like DNA. You know, <laughs> you know like a okay, Bob. I see you. Okay, this is definitely. I feel like it's my favorite from the title tracks as well. There was lions, tigers, and bears. But I did this version because I'm assuming there was a Japanese version before. Jungle. I was not what I was expecting. Okay. Me realizing there's no English. <laughs> it's alright, whatever. I'm trying to learn their voices here. Yeah, like Max is a 
softer, higher woods, but like just barely. Oh, okay. I imagine cool choreo here. Yeah, but Nuno's voice isn't that deep, so yeah, I'm gonna get them confused. Until we hear them enough. With only these two. I actually really like the song. I don't know if I like the chorus. Like the instrumental part of it. Okay. You can't hear them because I can edit it out, but geez, they're being annoying. Oh, what did I broke down there? Okay. I like Rodeo more. But Jungle, the first thing only happened twice. So actually, I really like that. I thought, I thought that actually sounded really nice. Really like another song of theirs. Like something that would be in their, one of the first albums. Uh, is it Greece? Not Greece. I want to say Teen Beach movie, but what, what was Teen Beach movie like inspired by? Footloose? Not Footloose. Was it Greece? Maybe it was Greece. But I don't think Greece songs sound like this. It's a little different. It's more like disco y, I guess. Dirty dance? Not dirty dancing. Maybe that's probably something something you know. Like I can imagine this in like a older movie um, school dance scene. Okay, I really like this sound with them too. This is very different from what wrote it, but I like both of those very much.
Bob. Very much loved it. Din Din. Din Din. Similarly to Super Junior D and E, Don't Hey did, did like did a feature on his like solo song, and Onyok didn't. <laughs> this is like the same thing here. You know, did a feature, but Max is on his own. Oh, oh, this is not what I thought, you know, it's how like, like, his little song. Okay. Very different from what I was thinking. Okay. He defied my expectations. I don't know what I was expecting. Not this. It sounds like key, like Chinese key songs, like his music. Okay. This is actually really similar to Life of Dance, like that type of music. Okay, this could easily be my favorite. Very much. I usually don't care much for this music, but it's just very vibey. Like he, his, his his albums are like the only ones I really vibe with when it comes to the sub sound. But I'm just biased because I like he. Okay, that was very surprisingly amazing. Now I'm, I'm curious about Max, because I don't know, I just wasn't expecting that sound from, you know. Why well, I thought maybe Max would sound more like that. Okay, you know what's that fun music? The instrumental is so weird. I don't know why this album sounds so different than I thought it was. 
Which is why I was very curious about it, because I was like, we're gonna leap like a good 10 years, I guess. Like 10 years, I feel like. <sighs> and I had no idea what, like, but then again, Rebel and Downward. If I just thought, you know, those are just child tracks. This is not a bad thing, though. This is not a bad thing. I very much enjoy it. I'm just like, oh, this is way different than I thought. <laughs> Or their solo songs are my favorite ones. But I liked all the other songs. I just, I don't know. Mm -hmm. You take my breath away. <laughs> His voice reminds me of someone. What's this from Miami? Something from It's specifically it like, na, 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 na. like it just sounds like his voice is like. <laughs> wait, I, I, like, wait, 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 wait. No, I'm gonna say yes, song from Super Junior, but that doesn't make much sense. Maybe like the way Ye Sung's No, I don't think it's Ye Sung. I don't know who I'm thinking of. His his voice just reminds me of someone. But it's not anyone new. It's like maybe like a second or third gen singer. Is this EXO? No, no one in EXO. Maybe Baekhyun. Like his voice was, was very thick in that song. So, I'm not gonna bother me. Very different sounding here. <laughs> like the song. They're very much giving us a lot to unpack. A lot of different sounds. Oh, it's forever gonna bother me. Who he sounds like. And I've only just noticed it. Oh. Hung <laughs> Danny? Do I always forget their fandom in Cassiope? I'm so sorry, I don't know how to pronounce it. Yeah. That's why I'm always gonna forget because it's too big. <laughs> too big of a word. Because <laughs> they rec they re referenced it in. Was it in Take My Breath Away? The instrumental is very simple for this song. I think I clicked. I think I clicked who I. It sounds like. I, I think I clicked who I was thinking. I think I. I think I just realized.
Maybe that's I, I was probably thinking of how from Zero's one. But like it, when he sings a certain way. I mean, are we shocked? Every song's good. Are we shocked? I think some stand out more than others, but are we shocked that everything sounds great? I love the cute simplicity of this one. This is probably when I would listen to a lot. All right, final one. I don't think I could find anything for this one, so we just did the regular one. Sounds like a Christmas song. It's very wintry. Personally, biased to a good piano song. I think this is V, X, and a Q. That's cool. I just saw. I just realized that. Would be my favorite song i'm i really like take my breath away and starlight i like a good ballad they do great ballads so but then fix it and promise are just really fun i really like rodeo and jungle is fun too so i guess take my breath away starlight promise and fix it 
but everything else was amazing too and so were the title tracks the title tracks were actually really good for this comeback um a bit weird for me because i'm so used to their older title tracks so like it felt jarring of a difference but it was a good difference i was like oh okay they, they don't sound weird in the trendy music and i think that's good um sometimes i feel like they're one person i feel like their voices blend together very perfectly like this is gonna be a bit weird but they're pretty lucky that they were the two who stayed because their voices just balance very well obviously all five of theirs did but like if there was like just two i feel like for consistency because any of the two could have made a good song but like consistent wise for comebacks i think these two just work ironically well together um but that is it for this video let me know your favorites and i'll see you guys in the killing voice video bye